I'm not going to dive into things like how to achieve your goals, how to achieve that state of happiness. You know it all. You know everything. But there are these small things, small distractions that lead to bigger problems. Every decision in your life is like a brick in the wall that leads to the ultimate goal. Shapali and welcome to my channel. So today we are going to talk about how to simplify your life. Let's dive in. If you really want to make your life simple, you have to do these oh so simpler things in order to make your life beautiful and substantial. I know you must be thinking what is she talking about? Who wants a boring and simple life? We are hustling hard, we want to get that early retirement. But ultimate truth is that simple life is going to help you to achieve that space. With every rich and great experience in our life, we should become more happy, satisfied and we should get that sense of entitlement. But what is happening is completely opposite of that. We are becoming more needy, we are becoming more greedy and distracted. We all are going to achieve what we want in our life. It's all about the different timing. But after achieving everything, what's next? That my friend is the quest for life. When we look deeply into our lives, our actions, our conversations, we let go of things that doesn't serve us and we embrace the things that makes us grow, that makes us a better human being. Now let's talk about these things that we need to do in order to experience this kind of life. You are not the things you own. Before making any kind of purchase, ask yourself, do I really love this? Am I going to wear a lot of it? Asking a why before buying it's important and uh, you know when you will make these tiny changes you will be able to see the remarkable results. The point here is to be mindful of every purchase that you make in your life. Time block is a time management technique in which you divide your time into different blocks of time and each block is dedicated to a different task. This method was uh, invented by Elon Musk and he basically talks about how to focus on your work without any distractions. He gives 10 minutes every day to this method where he time blocks all his tasks and breaks bigger tasks into smaller ones. If you want to do it on an app, I use this app called Toggle. Uh, you can definitely see this app. I'll just leave the link in the description box. The mess that you create online by consuming all sort of content and by overusing the technology, it's called digital clutter. So starting from your phone, you can delete all your unwanted old pictures that you don't want anymore. Also delete the emails that you don't want to see in your mailbox. Declutter everything that is not necessary. I love talking. Talking has always been my guilty pleasure and uh, of course when I'm with my people and when I'm very comfortable but being a good listener has taught me a lot about patience. You know what's the best part about listening? It's that you have always something to gain. In a group of friends there always comes a time when you know everybody is in that intellectual phase and everybody wants to talk so you will always find that person who's always quiet. That person is not dumb, that person is not shy, that person is the smartest one in the group. Because there are going to be different opinions, there is no right or wrong ever. So save your energy for bigger and better things in life. The stress needs to go away. When we are stressed, we tend to make decisions that are not wise. So why not treat the culprit that is stress? So what I've started doing is I've started journaling down my thoughts and uh, you know I just write three to five sentences every night before I sleep. It helps me to declutter my unwanted thoughts from my mind. Very important to plan your day beforehand uh, because the quality of your day depends on that planning. So you can also do the self-talk if you don't like journaling. You can also do the self-talk. It might look like a task right now but trust me in the end it's worth it to have a stress-free life. One of the most important thing in life is to get your tasks done. From that I mean like everything. From taking shower, buying groceries to completing your project. Life is never going to be the same. 
so make the most out of those normal boring days and set your intentions straight that ways you will be able to do a lot more in less time so train your mind every day complaining is just pure poison it just takes you nowhere and makes you feel so helpless complaining is not good for your overall health because life is becoming stressful and if you keep adding layers of stress and keep complaining all the time it can be really bad for you you don't have to follow the aggressive routine of exercise you have to listen to your body's needs there are days when your body feels exhausted and you go to the gym and you watch everyone they're all pumped up and doing the high intensity workout you don't have to do that even a simple gentle walk would do wonders for your body so listen to your body on daily basis and work on that intuition sometimes all you have to do is nothing there are times when i have a lot of work on my plate and i get really confused and you know at that time i would just close my eyes and rest for a while our mind also gets tired just like our body so give yourself some time and just do nothing relax there is no race there is nothing to prove take that break and then continue whatever you are doing at the end i would just like to say that don't wait to live this is no rehearsal this is no dry run this is real life savor every moment see you another time peace out yeah.